I'm responsible for the safety programs unit and media relations as it pertains to traffic services. Traffic services is a specialized unit. We're responsible for the entire city, everything that has to do with vehicles, traffic, safe movement of all road users. That's what we do here at traffic. Even within traffic, we have specialized units that are responsible for specific tasks. And together we're responsible for all vehicle collision investigations and traffic related enforcement activities. Part of being a traffic officer, it's a great responsibility. We have to look at traffic safety. We look at awareness, traffic awareness. We look at education and we look at enforcement. Uh, all these parts together are required to ensure that we have the safest roads possible in our city. And a lot of times the motorists that we deal with, it's their first and only contact that they have with police. So it's very important that we have that contact, we remain professional and positive during the contact, and that they leave with a sense of security. Traffic safety is not about enforcement alone. We have to take a multi-pronged approach to traffic safety. It includes awareness, education, and enforcement. And part of my unit here at Traffic Safety Programs is to provide that awareness and that education, not only to members of the public and all officers, both uniform as well as our civilians. Collisions are responsible for more devastation to our citizens, financially and emotionally, than all other crimes put together. Traffic Safety Programs Unit is responsible for ensuring that there's awareness and education and we start those conversations where they don't exist and enhance the ones that do exist. We get calls from police officers in our divisions, in our neighborhood officer program, our community school liaison officer program, anything that has to do with traffic, they give us a call and we're considered traffic specialists and experts in our field and we'll provide them the material that they need to ensure that their communities are safe on the roads. We're like the crime prevention through environmental design for traffic services here at Safety Programs Unit. We provide awareness and education, we provide toolkits, packages, and information where it pertains to traffic safety. We want to make sure that traffic safety not only is in our roadways or on our sidewalks, but they lead into our safer communities. We talk about driving behaviors that contribute to our most serious collisions, resulting in serious injury and in sometimes death. Those driving behaviors that contribute to these collisions are speeding, aggressive driving, distracted driving, and impaired driving. It's important to know that the conversation starts with you, it starts at home, before the collision occurs. Traffic officers can do what divisional officers can do, but not all divisional officers can do what traffic officers do. And outside of the homicide squad, traffic services is the only other unit in the service that deals with death. Many of our traffic collision investigations deal with serious bodily harm or in some cases death. And part of that is to provide public information and awareness in regards to what's going on and provide updates in our investigations. Part of that is my job. My job as a media relations officer is to provide that public information and updates and information regarding our most serious collisions. Traffic officers are specialized officers that deal with serious collision investigations and in a lot of times they are the officer in charge from the beginning to the end of the investigation. They're responsible for scene management, identifying and speaking to witnesses or victims of, of crime holding people accountable if we're talking about an impaired uh, driver, whether it's by alcohol or drug, that investigating officer is not only responsible for the scene and the victim's needs, they're responsible for making sure that the driver is held to account, arrested, charged accordingly, and, and processed. We have experts in the field of alcohol um, investigation and identification. We have drug recognition evaluators um, that are specialists. We have reconstructionists. Some of these specialized units you heard from during police week and you took a look at behind the scenes of what they do and how they do. And they're all housed and part of our traffic services family. Traffic operations includes traffic services as well as parking enforcement unit. We're a team or a family of over 700 uniform members, both civilian and sworn. And we're the largest specialized unit in the Toronto Police Service. So we have cars, we have SUVs, we have specialized trucks equipped to do reconstruction work. We also have a motor squad. Uh, we have a fleet of over 30 motorcycles, they're all Harley Davidsons, a specialized trained officers that are responsible for not only traffic safety, but also secured escorts of uh, VIPs and dignitaries. A funny story, when I was nine years old, I grew up around traffic services and I used to see all the motorcycle officers, the motor squad, the wing wheels as they were referred to back in the day, uh, riding up and down the street. 
And I, I remember vividly telling my mom one day, I want to become one of those guys there, riding a motorcycle around and doing a great job and providing a service to this community. And here I am, 46 years later, uh, I'm also a motor squad officer, highly trained, as well as one of the supervisors in our traffic safety program unit. I want to thank you for joining us for Police Week. I hope you enjoyed our behind the scenes of how we do and what we do here at Traffic Services. From the Traffic Services Safety Unit, thank you very much for watching.